What's up everybody? This is Gamer CJE and welcome back to City Skylines. Today we're going to be building a cargo airport. It's going to be a nice complement to our industrial area here. We have a rail connection, we have a connection to our industrial bypass going up here to the main part of the city from our industrial zones here. We have our raw resource production right here. We have the agriculture, oil, and the ore as well as forestry here we have our just main general industry that takes those raw resources turns them into consumer goods and ships them off to the rest of the citizens anyway i think that this is going to be a good place hopefully to build our airport i don't know that for sure but the first thing we need to do is paint a an airport area now this is the same as the passenger airport. This painting of this uh, airport area is going to change the elevation of everywhere that you paint. So what you need to do is decide where the height that you want is for your entire airport. What road you want it to be level with because unfortunately it's not going to be level with everything. So. It seems like, I think what I'm gonna do is go with this right here. Hopefully that will work out fairly well and it won't be too big of a change. And I am gonna go ahead and paint it on both sides of this road. Like this. I know it's not gonna be perfect but we can go back and touch stuff up uh, as needed. So let's see, it looks like there are, that's really not that bad. I think I might even just leave, well, where's, so my main connection is gonna be right here. Um, so right off the bat to start off with, we are going to replace this two lane road with a four lane road so we can accept more traffic. That's going to be the medium industry road and I'm going to go ahead and replace that. I'm assuming, yeah, I'm going to have to rebuild this, um, this pedestrian crossing here because I don't want people walking across this intersection because it basically makes it completely unusable for vehicles. And that's something I don't want. All right, looks like we're gonna have to get rid of our snap points. Make this work. All right, here we go. And here as well, this is gonna be the last one. Perfect, now I'm gonna turn my snap points back on and let's double check that this intersection still prohibits people from using the crosswalks it does let's make sure people can actually still use it everywhere they need to and it looks like that was a success all right so what we need to do is go in here to transport airport area and i'm going to let's see air cargo i'm going to go ahead and click that that's going to make it so the stuff that we need comes up in the search and what we have here is cargo airport terminal. We also have an airport train, an airport cargo train station. And I'm not, I don't think I've ever used that before. I'm, gu I'm guessing that that is not, um, I'm just going to build it and look at it real quick. So this is... I'm trying to see if this is going to operate as a terminal or if this is in addition to the terminal. It looks like that is in addition to the terminal. So that I'm obviously not going to build that there. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of it for the moment. The next thing on the list. Let's see here. We could probably bring the rail line right here and end up having the rail station right there. But 
The question is, how exactly do we want to build this? So we have our terminal here. Can you build elevated roads to the runway? You can't. Okay. So those would have to be intersections. All right. Now, that is unfortunate because it makes basically this area not super usable. Because I don't think it's going to be big enough. can be built as a place for cargo trains to load and unload raw material connect train tracks okay but what is that why is it specifically good for the airport hmm you know what it may not be specifically good for the airport so we may just uh, stay away from using that all right now let's see Ooh. I used the wrong button. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and build this. Because it looks like... Okay, so this is the road that connects to the city streets. This is the road that you build... Let me see here. The cargo aircraft stands on. This is a taxiway you connect to the runway. Okay. Um... That is also not ideal. So I think maybe the best way to do this is to build it pretty close to our medium cargo road there. Okay, let's go back to the terminal. Get it as close as I can to parallel with that road. I'm going to come out just, say... right here and then we're going to come out here with this same four lane road at the center so like pretty close just like that now we're going to use the two lane one way industrial road come all the way as far as I can over here just like that same thing on this side and the reason I'm doing this is I'm hoping it's going to give me better options with traffic yeah, let's make sure Ooh, we didn't have coverage I'm glad I looked at that okay might as well just cover this entire area now all the way over there and all the way over to there Okay, so we now have our metro poly, or for the moment, just so I keep track of what's what, I'm just going to say that this is Stockton Cargo Airport. And if one of y'all come up with a better name and leave it in the comments, I will, of course, change the name. But... That's all I can think of right now. Okay, so we've got this intersection right here, which every intersection that you put into your city is going to make the traffic worse. I don't really think that there's anything you can do about that. You just try to keep them to a minimum, but uh, there's only so much you can do. All right, so. Bummer. Okay, I was hoping that you could change things about this air, airport terminal. Because my, my assumption is that you can put the air, uh, the airplane stand uh, on either the small or the large here. So I think what I may do is completely ignore that um, large aircraft the larger road coming out of the terminal. 
just use these for on this small road right here. Now, one thing you can do is connect to this road from here, but I don't know exactly what good that does. I think what I'll do is uh, let's put in a runway here and kind of see how it's going to work out. So let's go take care of this put in a runway real quick. And fortunately, these runways can be very short. Ooh, there we go. Let's see if that's gonna work for us. Now we need taxiway. Not quite long enough. They're coming out of the room. Ooh, there we go. Okay, very height there um, I don't know that it's going to be quite enough to make these work but Now, I'm going to let this run real quick, and wait, do I have everything I need? Let's go back to cargo. I have the terminal, I have the aircraft stands connected to the terminal, I have the taxiways and the runway. So, I'm going to let this run real quick. Okay. We're currently at level one. And... Man, I really hope this works correctly. I don't think there has been anything coming in yet, but I do have that is a cargo. It is a cargo airport terminal, and these are cargo aircraft stands. I hope that the runway doesn't necessarily matter exactly which one it is. Um. I will be happy just when one plane does something. Let's see what's this. Road maintenance truck. Uh, I think that hopefully I'm not too close to the rail station here for this even to get used. Because that would be a major bummer. Looks like everything is connected. This says operating, correct? Operating normally. Okay. We have our first, we have a forestry truck coming in. Here's our forestry truck. Oh, we have a bunch of trucks. Excellent. Okay. So here they come. Filling up cargo airplanes. This one is oil truck, I think. So, in theory, this means that this setup is going to work. Now, one thing I would like to try, let's get this two-lane road and connect it up here, see what happens. Okay, they do bypass the terminal, and I think that is making stuff go faster, work better. So we have quite a bit of traffic coming in here, which is good dropping off their cargo it must take quite a bit to fill up these planes because I still have we still haven't filled up a plane yet and there's been quite a, oh there we go our first plane colossal cargo wow look at all those wheels one two three four five sets of wheels on each side I wonder if that's real there's planes that have five sets of wheels on each side all right let's see how this is gonna work I'm gonna go out onto the runway and take off all right well uh oh here we have a second one let's see what this one is 
OX. Huh. I was trying to think of something funny to say about that, but I couldn't. All right, well, it looks like we have successfully created our Stockton Cargo Airport. Like I said, if you can come up with a better name, I'll be happy to change it if you put it in the comments. Uh, let's see if this is gonna be Colossal Air, Colossal Cargo. All right, man, that is a big plane. Look at that. I don't, I don't recognize what kind of plane that is. Not a 747. Interesting. If anybody knows what kind of plane that is, put that in the comments too. All right. Well, we have a functioning cargo airport. My hope would be that that is going to complement our rail station. That's going to complement our industrial area. And uh, it's going to complement our city, make our city better. That would be the ideal outcome of this situation. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe and join me next time.